stomach. The suspect is on the run tonight. News 5's Alan Carter has the latest. It's probably not what you would expect to see when you think of a school shooting. When we got there, the scene was cleared, but less than an hour earlier, a student at Viger High School was shot. Then we looked. We were right down After that, then we seen the police pulling him. And yeah, I walked through and they said the he had got shot. The incident happening just before 4 o'clock after school had been let out. Students say it came with little warning, just hearing the shots, then walking over to find a classmate on the ground. They was like trying to go see was he all right, so I walked over there. He was just laying on the ground. The victim hit once in the stomach and taken to a hospital in stable condition. He was still yeah, he was still, he, he, he was conscious, like he still seeing what happened. It looked like he ain't hurt him that bad, though. The victim, a 10th grader at Viger, at this time police don't believe the shooter was another student there. All we can tell is that they were both juveniles, the victim and the assailant and it is believed that they had um, common knowledge of each other prior to this incident. Police have an idea of their suspect, though he has not been apprehended. Anytime you have an incident like this that occurs on school campus, it's a, a, a tragedy, whether it's a, a killing or just a simple assault. Because when you, when you have things like this, other things could lead up to more serious matters. And again, police still looking for the shooter. If you have any information on this incident, you're asked to call Pritchard Police. Reporting live in the newsroom, Alan Carter.